Jeremy is an oil producing community in Ugeli South local government area of Delta State and since 2012 perennial flooding has become the lot of this community. Increasing levels of flood water caused by an overflow of the river Niger has left many households struggling to salvage what is left of their properties. See, I had to do a lot to sunfill this place to be able to see it this way. So we believe that if government should help us, come and help us fill and fill the whole place to this level, that problem will not be there because the canal is there to take the water away. But because this place is low, it's like a valley. You see, water will always come in here. The flood waters also pose a health risk even as the residents here try to live their lives as normally as they can. Mosquito, eh? it be like fly for us. Eh, when they feel asleep, everywhere, as so mosquito, snakes, eh, for they come meet us. Malaria, and I be the fever now. Malaria, they worry us every now and then. We go treat today, tomorrow we go get. Malaria, oh, call for Qatar because of the cold weather of this water. So I hold some of uh, these uh, uh, fishes, catfish. The, when the water comes from the flood away from the through, through the process of the flood, my pla my plantain of the f fell out, my rock are outside. Farmland, livestock, and fish farms have been destroyed, while movement from one place to another is now a tedious exercise for those who have decided not to leave their homes. The Delta State Commissioner for Information explains the cause of the flood. Development and so many other factors have led to the shrinking of the size of the river Niger, as well as the different tributaries and estuaries of the river of the Niger. And then what happens? Water, they say, must find its level. That now means that water now finds its way into different communities. But what we have done, first of all, is to ensure that our people move up land. But is that a permanent solution? No. Because we know that's not a permanent solution, that is why our Ministry of Environment is engaged in the process of deceiving a number of these water channels, even as we continue to construct much more or larger volumes of drains to enable us to save our communities from this um, upsurge of flood water. He also calls on the federal government to complement efforts of the state government by finding a solution to the issues through flood prevention and control.